Welcome to Audio Tips. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to add additional content in your Pro Tools software. Basically, this is for the beginners who are new to Pro Tools. Uh, as soon as you install the Pro Tools software from a CD or from the internet or wherever you install it from, you're not going to have all the additional updates or the additional content uh, that's up to date. What you're going to have to do is go in and manually uh, update it. So I'm going to show you guys how to quickly do that. Uh, disregard this screen. You can be in a session or or you can be doing anything and you can always check for it. You're going to go up to the bar where it says Pro Tools, File, and all this other stuff. And you're going to quickly go to Help. Uh, you're going to go at the bottom, you're going to see something that says Check for Updates. You're going to click it and it's going to check for updates. And if it finds something new, a screen that looks like this is going to pop up. It's going to say New, new Pro Tools Software uh, Updates Available. You're going to click the details. And then it'll show you all the details here. You can view the updates, or or you can just uh, well, basically you can view the updates. It's gonna look a little something like this. Uh, and as soon as you you want the current version, you're gonna click on it, and it's gonna open you up something that looks like this. You're gonna click on here. It's gonna take you to a screen that looks like this. We're going to go down to downloads. You know, me, I have a Mac, so I'm going to download this uh, 10.3.9. Yep. Yeah. I'm going to hit download. Uh, we can store it wherever. I'm going to go into my uh, documents. And basically, it'll start downloading. Then you just go install it like, uh, like, you, regu like you regularly installed the software. Hope you guys learned something new. Hope this was helpful. Uh, please subscribe and enjoy.